Morning, I'm at the uh, Bristol Hunters course, Bristol Club Hunters course, the Pirates Club Hunters course today and I'm putting a bit of practice ready for the Sussex shoot. I'm using this lovely dragonfly frame with optic sight from John Cleave, who's our other presenter. Um, this is shot number one, just so I thought I'd just run you through the whole course today, see how it goes. So that you know what you're getting into when you come down to shoot our course. There's, there's shot number one. A little bit windy yet. As you can probably hear, it's really windy. Right, so that's number one. Right the way over there. Shot two is off the same peg. I'll just turn it around to shot two here. Up through the trees. Maybe you can be able to see it. I don't know if I can see it. There he is. Right through the trees in there. Like I said, it's really windy today, so try and get a shot off, off on him. Not sure I'm gonna be able to hit this without the um, with all the wind. No, it's not even impossible to get through the buddy. So I'm gonna leave shot two. It's a long old shot. When it's calm weather, you can pretty easy, it's all shot over this ring here, all this side of the course is shot over this ring, so that's shot two right up through the trees there. Okay so this is shot three, like I say it's still really windy, not making excuses but just uh, I can't even find him now, <laughs> Look, oh there he is, right behind there, have a quick crack at this one, and on to the next. There we are, first shot, thank gold. This is just to give you a rundown of, of what the course is act actually is, what it looks like. Um, we're going to be putting on again in two weeks, so um, you're all welcome to come down. It's a free lunch, £10 a pop for the course. And let's get on to now shot number four, that was three, so yeah, number four is an 80 mil, I think. About around 10 metres. This shot is a pretty basic one. Just through the trees here. Let me just get this camera sorted out. Let's go on a bit. There he is. It's around 10 metres this shot. So standard shot for anyone really. Possibly missed it now I've said that. Wait for the wind. Horrific day. Boiling, but it's uh, very, very windy. There you go, second shot. Two points on that one, and again it's over the over the little ring here. It's the first part of the course all the way down here, and the last three shots on this side are literally just next door. Hold fire! Okay, 
Okay, so these three shots here and we'll sort this are number one. Is in there. Number two is up in the ivy, we call this one the squirrel shot. And then number three is right over there, 21 meter five, I think that one is. We've laser measured every one of these. When you shoot the course, your score sheet should have this next time on, on it, would be the um, actual distances of the shots so that you can use your different reference points. Well, come in handy for shooters. So shot one, well now five, shot five, but one of these three. Let me see if I can get this. There you go, first shot. Now let's go up in the ivy. For the squirrel shot, I really like this shot. All of these can be shot from anywhere on this side of the bank. The rest of them are behind the line shots. Here we go, second shot from the squirrel. Now we're going for the long one. Try this one over here. This is a really, a really a tough shot. So I think it's a 50 mil and it's 21 meter. But uh, I don't hold much confidence in this shot. I have had it before, first time round. But let's see what we can do. Three shots per target. That's the end of that. I'll have to watch this back and see, if, see how close I did get on that one. Um, so that's five, six, seven, I think. And let's get off to shot number eight, which is a tiny little uh, 30 mil, I think, at about 80 meters. So yeah, actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk you around there. These are the three shots I've just taken in this bit. You know, path comes around here. This is the seating waiting area. So where we and uh, we have a practice range in there. When the shoot's on, and let's just take you around the course. Might as well see the whole thing, just to try and entice a few more heads to come down and compete at a course. We have good prizes, usually catapults. So, like I said, it's a ten, ten pound each. Um, you get a free lunch, just free water, drinks, um, bags of crisps, and whatever else. Keep everyone happy. And this is. Uh, I think eight, number eight or nine. And he is up in that woods there. Let's have a look here. One second. You see him there. It's a long old shot. But let's see if I can get him. Sorry about that. Right. Let's have a crack. that twig that's what the hunters course is all about though there's anything in your way you have to deal with it to get around it up or down it there's a also a shot later on that you'll see is through a fence and that's my third shot if we're not if we scored out on that one no good 
Sorry about the uh, bad camera work here. Let's get on to the next lot. Okay, so this camera here. This is let's call it shot nine. It's a little uh, 30 mil yellow spinner, and it's just literally right in front of you, but it's shooting down. And it, it is actually <laughs> more, more people miss this shot than. Uh, than any other, I think. If I remember rightly. There you go, first time, so that's three points. For those who don't know the scoring system, it's uh, three points. First shot, three points, second point, second shot, two points, and if you get on the third shot, it's one point. That's how the uh, Hunters courses are scored, as far as I know, all of them. This one is pretty long. I think it's a 40 mil, around 18 meters, 16, 17 meters. You can see there on my battering it's had since we've had this course up. Let me try this one. Miles out. A bit rushing really, I should just calm down with that. And I'm going to run out of ammo, so I'm going to have to go and grab some ammo up my bag a minute after this next shot. That's the three on that one. So I've scored out again. Beginning to wish I hadn't filmed this. <laughs> right, next shot is off the same peg. I don't know if you can see it through there. There's a little spinner on a tree there. I think this is a 40 mil. Yep, I'm pretty sure it's a 40 mil. From around 10 meters shooting downwards on uneven ground. So this course does tend to test people. Um, and you shoot it twice around, there's 15 targets and if you go twice around, so the ones you did miss that you knew that you could hit, you get to do, to do all again, so. And it's the total score over the two rounds. I think my highest score on this course is a 57 so far. And you're not going to get that with shots like that. <laughs> Last shot on this one, just wait for the wind. Probably hear it. See my band flapping. Flapping for the wind. Yeah, scored out again. Oh well. Can we grab some ammunition. And we'll be on to the next shot. Let's get on to the next shot, it's just river down here, this is a dark one. It's on the left hand side of the path. And it's really in the dark, there's no light in there at all. It's an 80 mil, which just, it just provides an easier this shot. I uh, know I've lost where I am, there it is. Um, there. Just about, not sure. But let me just move this camera over a sec. Right, let's try this again. There he is, there he is. You can see the beating that's had. Let me try my luck on this one. Again, I think this one's about 16 meters. It's in the dark. Miss. Yeah, 
there we go, second shot, two points. Not doing well today at all. And that is a hell of a shot up through there. Then, just right behind us, through these woods here, sort us out. And the next shot, some ammunition's dropping in there. Right, we come down into the woods. We've got four shots in here, which finishes, of course. Sorry for this. Right. You have to stand in this square. That used to be a square. I think the kids have been down here messing around. Um, the first shot is in the V of this tree. So, let's crack him. I am shooting terrible today. Quite a bit of nerves, I reckon, and a bit of wind. Not great. Come on, Kev. Oh! Strokes out on a really easy shot. And uh, the next one is just the base of this tree. You can just see the top of it through the reeds there. Call this one the rabbit shot. Let's see what I can do here. If I miss this one, I'm going to be highly prepared. Oh, and he did miss it. I think I took a bloody oh, a bit of the green down. Let's have a look. Let's try that one again. I'm real. What am I doing today? Sorry. Now, you take all these four shots from the square, and this one is a little red, a little red. Uh, Spinner here. Let's go right in and see if we can hit this. There you go, first shot. But I'll tell you what, I missed that one. The last two, because they were just huge compared to that one. And this is the trickiest one of them all. The final shot, the through the fence. An 80 mil spinner, but you have to find a reference point where well, your, your, your aiming point on the target, and you need to reference through the hole in the fence or any of these holes in this chain link fence, sort of like that. Good old gamer. And then aim up with your catapult as well. So it's really a tough shot to get. I've got three shots on this one now, so let's see what I can do. Oh, not good at all. Oh, I'm going to take one more of this just just because I know I can get it. I've got it during the last competition on first shot. I don't know what's going on today, but I reckon I can get it. Oh, come on, last one. Yes, finally. I wouldn't have counted in the competition anyway. So there you go. So. That was uh, Bristol Hunter's course. Let me just sort this camera up, one sec. Yeah, that's Bristol Hunter's course. Bristol Pirates Club Hunter's course. And uh, all welcome to come down 
any time you shoot the course, you do two rounds of that, you get a free lunch, it's £10 a pot. It's an easy day out for a load, load of other people you know, with the same interest. And uh, yeah, come and join us. Glad to have you.